Yo, what's going on? Peace, Facebook. Um, listen, I want to discuss something with you right quick. There's, there's a technique that the European uses all the time in order to change a condition or to make things different for themselves. Remember I told you a while back that the ideology of race, the man-made social, social construct was basically designed for them and their survival. You understand? And in any time their survival is challenged or threatened, they find a way to alter that. You understand? And one of the ways that they do it is by getting inside of a situation and altering and changing the situation from the inside. This is a reality that we must examine as we are moving into the 21st century. I mean, we're actually are, we're there already. But as we move in, we have to take into consideration some of these things that I'm talking about right now, especially this particular topic that I'm speaking of. If you really want to change something, if you really want things to get different, you can't do it from the outside. You really have to get inside of the social institution, organization, affiliation or whatever you're trying to alter or to change. You have to get inside of it in order to get a piece of it to make the change occur. You see what I'm saying? We can't really change certain things from the outside. Now, when we study the Europeans, and we look at people like J. Edgar Hoover, and we understand the science of COINTELPRO, and how that was utilized, how they placed people inside of organizations to tear the organization down from the inside out. You understand? And then they extracted, and then they gave out information, misinformation, that would actually turn the people against the group the organization, the institution, so on and so forth. It is the same type of thing that we must take into consideration. We want to change things. We want to see things change. Well, we must begin to raise up people in our community, raise our seeds up and teach them certain things and teach them a certain way of thinking. You understand? So they will walk inside of an institution or a society with a particular mindset. And understand how that mindset will work and benefit them and their people. Now, people will say, well, you know, you, you talking racist or pre prejudice. No, I'm not. I'm talking about what everybody does. You understand what I'm saying? I'm talking about something that is taken into consideration and utilized. For instance, the Ku Klux Klan. Yeah, they exist. You know what I'm saying? But guess what they've done? Yeah, they still wear hoods, but they've taken the hoods off and they've assimilated into mainstream society. Their teachers, their police. They're ministers, they're doctors and lawyers. You understand what I'm saying? So whatever agenda they want to propose or push forward, they can do it because they're actually walking inside the institutions and are in these institutions. Look at um, uh, uh, the organization called NAMBLA, the, 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 men, the men lovers who love little boys. The guy got on television, on video and said, we are in all aspects of your society. You understand what I'm saying? They're everywhere. It is the same thing. When you want something to benefit you or your agenda, you got to get inside of it and alter it and switch it around and make it benefit you. But in order to do that, you got to raise up a particular type of being to do this. Because, see, once you get in certain societies and certain circles, they begin to alter the way you think. And you no longer become what you thought you were going to do, like becoming a cop to protect and serve. That's the job. But when you get inside and you realize that you alone, you become a part of that problem. But if you got brothers and sisters going into any institution with a particular mindset, they already know what to examine and what to look out for, how to defend against it and how to utilize all that training that they brought up to slide into these institutions and to alter them from the inside out. You want to change police? You want to change police brutality? Become a police. I know you, you don't understand what I'm saying right now, but really, the key word is infiltration. Learn how to infiltrate. You understand what I'm saying? And be quiet as you do it. Because many societies do this, and they've already done it, and this is why you see things a certain way, but you can never get what you want, people. We can never get what we want because we're not inside the institutions trying to alter them or change them. You understand? We're talking about it, and we're marching, and we're doing certain things, but we're not infiltrating, man. Be the spook who sat by the door, yo. Peace.